I'm Corporal Remington Hall, and this is the Corps Report. Last week, Secretary of Defense Ash Carter approved the Marine Corps Force Integration Implementation Plan. The plan outlines how the Corps is going to begin the process of opening all ground combat arms jobs to women. See the link in the video description to find out more about the plan. Exercise Songyong 16 kicked off in the Republic of Korea, bringing together service members from the US, Republic of Korea, Australia, and New Zealand. The exercise is something for everyone. Beach landings, flight operations, personnel exchanges, and that one word that we all love but have a lot of trouble pronouncing. To keep up with everything Song Yong, see the link in the video description. In case you missed it, the Commandant spoke at the Future of War conference and answered the question, how will Marines fight in the future? Hint, it's not with phaser guns. General Neller spoke about how he wants to put new technology in the hands of Marines and sailors, because you're always trying to be the one that drives the tempo to make the adversary change to your capability, not the other way around. Also, when asked why Marine Corps uniforms are so much better than any other services, the Commandant's response was just, yes. Enough said, sir. And in case you guys forgot, the new uniform policy leaves the seasonal uniform changes up to commanders, which means I've still got a few more weeks to get these guys in prime condition. That's all for this week. See you next payday, right here on the Corps Report.